Sandy. I definitely want to show that to Sand. And see what he thinks. Because he likes baking, too. But we have to have, like, a, a good reason to set it up and do it, you know? And I think something like that, for me, would satisfy that reason. <laughs> Yeah, I figured that if it's gonna be paywall, there'll probably be some of the complex stuff on there, too. All in one bonus? Well, it lasted, but then I made two mistakes and offset the bonus that the hole in one gave me. I'll reduce the. I think I'll take this out. I'll... I used to make my mic one decibel louder. I don't know if I'm talking loud enough or if when I see the mic go all the way up into the yellows and reds that it's just because of a, a plosive or something that I say. So I want to sound at least a little bit louder and better. I want to make sure I'm loud enough. Just in general. <laughs> I listened to the VOD back from yesterday and that was my general impression that I may have been a, a touch quiet. Except for you know, plosives coming through. Which I knew were a thing going into this mic. I don't really, I don't care too much about it. I'm not invested in making it a perfect mic sound. That'll handle all of that. And my freaking dashboard is broken again. Why does it do that randomly? It's like, why does it do that? That's the third or fourth time this has happened. It just like shifts itself up and there's no scroll bar. So now there's just, like, a, a black bar at the bottom of it, and I can't see, like, any of the stats at the top, because all of the stats are at the top. They're all cut off now. <laughs> like, I literally have to refresh to fix it, I think. Thanks, Twitch. Epic gaming on your part. <laughs> Beautiful shot there. No, I refreshed and it did it again. What the heck? It's broken. What is happening? My dashboard is just fricked now. Even though I refreshed, it's still doing the same thing. Uh, I mean, it's not a big deal. I can still see chat. You guys are the most important part anyway, so... Who cares about any of that other crap? I'll just use my broken dashboard that works for chat. <laughs> okay. What the heck, dude? Freaking Twitch. Ooh, I like this. No, I don't like it? Wow, that got so... Oh my god, that's awful. Why did that work? It doesn't... I, uh, nothing's equating right now. Uh, <laughs> I'm imploding. Quite possibly, Nat. Why am I hooking everything? I don't like that either. And I really need to know my pin locations on this hole, because I thought this was back pin, and I played it short on purpose to deal with the downslope. And it wasn't back pin, so I got screwed and I had to make a harder putt. Really need to know that. Nice shot. Okay. At least I am aware of all of these things. It's the first step. Nice I think a slice is better here. Yeah, it's rough bound anyways. Got a little bold there with the full top, but I felt it. I felt the impulse at the last second before I finished that shot. I was like, I'm, I'm doing it. I'm fucking doing it. It's gonna happen. I'm full topping. I appreciate it, Seover. Good to see you tonight. Have a lovely rest of your night as well. And keep your head in the game for your work weeks. Or do whatever's most healthy for you in the moment. Does it tell you yardage to pin? 
Um, it tells... Yes, it does. Sorry. If you're on the green, it's meters, though. In this version. <laughs> Lost my brain for a second there. Alright. Beautiful Lakitu here. A couple seconds slow, but it'll actually work pretty well. I believe my gold is at 526, so this is not bad. Hello, Pokemon. Hope you're having a great Thursday evening, Friday morning. And the only other thing I'm really active with this week is the weather challenge. This is the um, fourth city of this semester in two-week increments. And I have done the first three days well enough to where I am currently second in the world. So I've been focusing a lot on observations for Saginaw, Michigan. Which is where I'm forecasting this time. Because being second in the world right now means I have a pretty good shot at getting a trophy this time. Except, of course, the first place person in the world right now is also in the same category as me. A frickin' course. Now they decide to do really well. But we'll see how they hold up. <laughs> I'm hoping for a trophy. If I get a trophy for this city, it'll be my 10th one across four years of the weather challenge. No, five years. Well, this is my fifth year doing it, so... Ten trophies. Pretty good. Is there a good way to learn the route besides watching run? I mean, define good would be different for every person, because what I did to make the, the routing that I use, generally in any percent, back in the day, I did the science to figure out what shot I wanted to hit on each hole. And over time, like, of course, that devolved into some second shot adaptations for different pin locations, but when I made my own routing, I did it with the different pin locations in mind. A tee shot that would work for both, essentially. I did all of that routing back in the day, and I learned it and op like optimized it over time. Imagine. Oh. And then, of course, I made it available. So, like, I think I did, at least. And then I make it available because I stream it. <laughs> For star attorneys? Yeah. I think you should. I mean, that's really what you do. Because you can watch the run. You can watch my runs, but... Also... You're not playing the game. Typically, you're not playing the game simultaneously and learning it for yourself and, you know, getting used to the inputs because an important part of being able to route and use a route of something is the muscle memory and the familiarity with it in the physical sense. Imagine you watched runs for six months. I streamed these, these runs for six months and you're intimately familiar with what I do on every hole. You know, with some... Um, with some budging allowed, you know, for some odd circumstances. And then you start trying to do it on your own, you realize you're all shaky or whatever. Or even though you know what to do, you're like, oh god, I, this is hard, or this part is weird, or I'm scared of this, and or maybe you're a couple frames off in your timing here and there, and you're like, oh man. And then trying to remember everything in the moment, too, because it's happening fast in front of your face. It's a whole different thing. But in this game, there is really no getting around the time requirement to becoming adequate in running it. There's just... you just really need the time requirement because of that physical familiarity with it being so important. Bitch, that sucks. That hook is so bad. Chip in. Nice bird. 
basically the slowest I could be. Nice 610. Could have topped that some. My goal here is approach distance, which I got easy. Slow. Oh my god! What? <laughs> nice shot. Oh my goodness, that is slow. I don't like that. Mm, okay. Oh my god. Nice. At least. All right, manageable. I want to get the heck to the late game, though. I'm sorry I haven't gotten any runs tonight or last stream. Out of sands. I think I made it to blooper once last stream or something like that. That's my bad. I know this is a reset heavy category, but I just want to literally chill. And when a run happens, it'll happen. And I am going to be... I'm probably suffering as a result because I'm not going to be very familiar with... I I'm... I, eh. I'm decently familiar with Peaches just thinking about it, but Badlands I might be a little crappy on. Which is bad, because I have time save there. Probably didn't want to top it so much with the hook, but I didn't have a choice. Because it wasn't going to work anyways. Got lucky. Did make it 310 yards, but <laughs> not in the direction of the pin, so no approach distance there. Bad. Ah, all right, come on, come on, we can do this. <laughs> yes. I actually should have put some draw on this if I wanted to fully optimize the shot, but this won't be this won't be too bad, I think. Debating to uh, backspin. I think I needed it. Get the heck in there. Let's go, dude. Alright, actually average time despite perfect score. Good pin location here. Alright, we're starting up something nice here. Let's see how far I can take it. I really want to take it far. That's... Mm, I probably should have super backed. I hit the upslope, though. Oh, dude, super back was in. I. Ah, oh, man, it was. It would have had a chance of going in at least. Dang it! <laughs> I knew it. Oh, I knew it. Rats. Is there any kind of pin manip? No. Not in this game. Pin locations are just you get them and you suck it up. Shoot that hook. Oh my god! What the heck? Yeah, luckily there is there's the way the pin locations work are different is different based on the mode. So Star Attorneys has three out of four of each hole's pin locations, but they're the hardest three out of four randomly selected between those three. The easiest one is removed, and that's on every course. But any, in any percent or the regular tournaments, you only get two out of four on the first three courses. They're the easiest two, theoretically. Wow. 
Okay. And then on the latter three courses, so blooper through Badlands, you can get three out of four, but not the hardest one. So you can kind of see they're like balanced in a way, depending on the game mode. And in Stroke Play, you can get all four of them, which is rough. And some other modes, you can get all four as well. Things like Ring Attack, they're limited like any percent would be. Or regular attorneys would be. Just call it any percent. <laughs> so used to it. That's gotta get there. Wow. Okay, that would have been really stupid to lose. But I wanted to putt it because it's so much faster. This will end up on the right side. I had a good setup to try to go for the ace here, but yeah, the slice isn't gonna cut it. Ironically enough. <laughs> No, s the slice not cutting it? Man, you got a blunt tool there, don't you? <laughs> Alright, sorry, I'm just entertaining myself. While I go for th through the stresses of star attorneys, I need it. Kind of RNG to make me growl. Well, now we see if the run dies. five is yeah it's not enough to warrant a top spin that was panic Christ <laughs> woof that was a close one You can do them in any order, but I don't want to do blooper right now. Nice huh. I just always barely survive it, yeah. They're, this... It's not the same stress as Resetless 108, but it is certainly an, inter an interesting and entertaining stress. For me, and I hope for you as well. Star Tourneys is really cool. Really cool category. How are you doing, Striker? Okay, didn't play a power shot here, so I don't know what to do. And I think I overhit it. Just unfamiliarity with the shots I'm playing, making me do stupid crap. This is in the bunker, too. Oh my god, dude. I had half a mind to skip this, too. What the f What's that, dude? Nice on. Birdie bird. Nice bird. Well, okay. Whatever works. Nice shot. We have the jam, we do. You have to go out of your way to get the boost room? Hmm. At least you have access to it, I think. Sounds like you do. Yes! I didn't know if that was going in. Took a while to zoom in. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> of course, absolute horse crap uh, conditions for this, but I think I actually made this work well. Yeah, it's coming right back down. Let's go, dude. Damn. <laughs> That's good. I think to get sub hour, you should do that, Hef. Because, and then blooper. Blooper Bowser or Bowser Blooper. You should do that because, um, although, getting a par 5 skip in Peaches was, would also be a huge uh, barrier that you could uh, surmount by doing it early. 
I still do Lakitu first because I want the par 5 skip and that's my huge barrier. If I don't get that later in the run, that's like stupid for me. Even though basically any par 5 skip or whatever I'm going for is the same way. I go for par 5 skip on every course. At least. I missed this putt so many times, yeah. That's so fucking stupid. I was thinking about it right when I was doing it, too. Okay, way to throw the eagle away. Good. I miss that putt every goddamn time. Don't know if I need to topspin this. Needed a slice for distance control. What's happening? My god. Don't like that. <laughs> Your controller working? You have a new one? I think you should I think you should try to enjoy the Star Attorney's attempts for what they are. A super challenge that doesn't require your perfection to know that you've done it well. <laughs> it doesn't you don't need to feel like some sort of pressure to perform in Star Attorneys, you just take what happens and you're like, wow, that was cool or you try to make the best out of it and feel like you accomplished something in that sense. Hello, Deo. Thank you for the raid. Tonight, I hope you had a chill Thursday evening, my friend. Hello, Pagina Steven and Tiki. Mainly Mave and G3. Good to see you guys. What's up, PS1? Wow, there's another PS1, I think. <laughs> Any PlayStation 1s in chat? I'm playing the super hard shit in this game, and it's fun as hell. And also, I'm pretty good at it, so that's all I have to tell you. Also, I have a new mic, so I sound sexy. And what else do you need to know, but other than you're chilling to some golf now? I don't know what else I could tell you. <laughs> Mario Golf on the PS1, right. That's what I'm playing right now. Doesn't it look amazing for a PlayStation 1 game? New mic. Sexier, thank you. It means a lot. You can always rely on you, Ninko. Thank you, old Steve. Oh, jeez. I can do ASMR now, too. I've got the tools. <laughs> I'm not going to do that, though, because I'm god-awful at it. You got to go mini-golfing. Um, well, you are putting in that game and not doing anything else. Well, you shouldn't be doing anything else. But if you want to do something else... Ayo. Uh... I mean, if you're happy with it, Hef, maybe. But I think maybe Peach is for the par 5 skip, unless you just assume that you can get it. 11 birdies. That's that's basically my... No, that's almost my all tourneys route. Not my all-star tourneys, but my all tourneys route. Basically that. This is a really good sands, by the way. I might gold here. I'm skipping 14 because this is a slow eagle, but it is one. But I don't need it to finish. You're bringing your 60 degree? Ooh. Little wedge action. I like to hear it. <laughs> you wedging? Waging on some wedges? Get some chip ins, my guy. Please go in. Thank you. That's really good. Red hot knife. We don't talk about that. How are you all doing, though? Great to have you tonight. I am a Toastal Tour speedrunner. Also Kirby Air Ride. I'm getting my foot back in the door here because I just moved. And so I lost my consistency. But now I am consistent and getting world records again. 
that's all I have to say. <laughs> also, this category is really hard. Nobody else has even gotten a sub hour in this category ever. And I have a 54. Now you know how hard it is. This is not enough draw. Boop. Not good. Oh, wait. The bounce, though. Oh, we're sticking it on the edge of reality. That's gonna bounce. And go up here. Kind of unique. Okay. I definitely threw the ball downhill. <laughs> Which is illegal in golf. You're supposed to use a club. But I can still make this work. Ooh, that was <laughs> a little dangerous. Make I like danger though. Makes things interesting. And we got the chips. And that's a sub nine. Huge. Let's go, dudes. 5455 is the record, but it's over two years old. And since those two years have passed, nobody else has still gotten a sub hour. This isn't the most popular category, but it is a really good one because it's super challenging. To play from the back tees, max win, difficult pin locations, and super hard cutoffs to match. To win the tournament, because you do have to win every tournament. That was my first sub nine star sands. Plus four, I think I'm green bouncing. Yep. Damn. I did this before, though. Let's go. Alright, I'm doing it! Mmm, maybe I won't do it. Oh, god. I'm scared, dude. Oh, I hate it. Alright. Oh, the booty. Sorry, forgot to tell you guys. I know you're interested in the booty. Do you get a booty shot in this run? This would be so hype. Yes! Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Jesus. Deo Raid gave me some energy here. Want that to hit the bunker. <gasps> okay. If it that rough there, I'd bounce off into my doom. I think that can bounce. Yeah, that's bouncing. Should have backspun it, actually. So, the premise of skipping a par 5 and blooper, I can only make four mistakes with no eagles across the whole course. Four mistakes. That's all I got. Usually I miss whole three birdie because that one's really hard. So, generally, I only have three after that point. I think I need a backspin on this bad boy, too. Hmm. I did. Please, dude. Yes! Oh my god. This is so good. Oof. Okay. Sucking it in right now. This is gonna hit the upslope, though. Really, really hope it doesn't. Oh, we're dead. Yep. Get the hell in there. Dude! It's meant to be right now. <laughs> no topspin here, because the fast fairy will make me roll into the bunk, and I don't want to be on the edge of the bunk. Even though typically I'm not on the edge, but being on the edge would be bad. No edging! Sorry. Normally I'm in support of edging, but not this time. Don't know why I said that in the world record VOD, you know? But so be it. Because this is going to get world record with Deo Man in the in the VOD. Shit, minus six. Go, my friend. Top spin away. Yes, the recovery. Minus six percent. That's like twelve yards cut. I made it work though. Beasting. Yes, perfect use of the command. Let's go. Let's go, dude. 
<laughs> Got him. I'm doing God's work here. That's why I have that command, by the way. In the event that I say something silly. This'll work. Jesus, man. Minus five again? Okay. No mistake, November. No like. This blooper is incredible. <laughs> this is faster than some of my front nines in any percent. Oh my god. 425. That's playing from the front tees, too. I want a mild upslope hit here. Nah, I didn't get it. Get the heck in there, dude. I am popping my pants right now. Let's go. Mm, I think that last second impact screwed me. Yeah. Two frame hook. What? Robbery. Dang it, no. <laughs> Test me now, game. Perfect, that's what I wanted. Let's see what you got. I wanted a super back, actually. Crap. Don't. Thank you. Alright, still three mistakes to make. I wish I had the four still, but... I had that I had that chip all lined up, but it ended up not working. I, that's the worst when that happens. Don't put me on the whale, please. Okay, nice. Probably should hit it full power here, but... Just play this. Plus one, so I'll top it more. We do a lot of topping here, if you didn't know. That was mistake number one, actually. I mean, I could have eagled whole nine, so, but I don't count that in my score count for making mistakes. So technically that was a mistake if I were perfect, but star tourneys, I can't even say that I could be perfect, so I don't include it. Oh. Uh... Oh, God. Hit the fast fairway anyways. Yeah, it was a little too chaotic of a shot. Probably shouldn't have tried to do anything fancy with it. I think this is bad. Mmm... Not gonna be a great spot here, just hopefully it's manageable. I think this is okay, right? Land 125? No, it's going a little further than that. Good. Yeah, that was mistake two, so I can make two more. I only need one more birdie. It's an easier reference point now. Right pin. Not a favorite. Four iron, yeah, okay. That plus one really screwed everything up, but I might have perfected it. Yeah, that was ideal. I got the fringe bounce there. Really hard to do. Fringe is a rougher surface with more friction when you land on it than uh, green is, so you bounce much less further if you hit the fringe. And that is definitely a calculated risk that I take sometimes. Because a green bounce is going to make you go like 10 yards further than a fringe nice. bounce, depending on the elevation, slope, etc. that you land on. So we're pretty safe here. In fact, I'm on gold pace by eagle. It's going to be really hard to eagle with this, though. To stick the fairway somehow. Don't think I... Should have done a power three or a four wood or something. No, no. 
Yeah, I should have not done this. I almost made that work, though. Gotta give me credit. Dude. <laughs> that would have been pretty sick. Still a gold, anyways. Damn. Okay, this is what I was talking about when I could have a good pace. Top with that? No? Wow. Okay. Maybe the first time nerves are setting in with this category. Hm. Oh shit. Oops. Sucks. somehow. Jeez. That was a shot. I shouldn't have super backspun it, but whatever. Chip in. Nice bird. Eh. Not great. Pull three. Terrible wind. Almost made it work, but yeah, I had a pretty weird shot. I super backspun it, so not much of a chance there. And then yeah, that hole is just subject to the shrooms. Top's been a bit of an overreaction here, but it works. Just gotta make the pots good. Alright, yeah, I'd prefer to be 10 seconds faster than this, but we'd all prefer being on world record pace, wouldn't we? Making the green on hole 6 star tourneys is a blessing. I'll take it, dude. Definitely got good luck here. Go for it, Ninko. Ugh, uh, I don't know what to do. Dr. Pepper hat? Nice. Actually, if you have a close eye... Well, you can't see it, but it's right here. This thing. Because my mic's in the way. I'll put it on after this run. I don't have time right now, I'm sorry. No, it's a Dr. Pepper hat. <laughs> Got the gamer camel. Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> camel? Camera angle. Gamer camera angle. Wow, my... Yeah, okay. Can't speak English right now, sorry. This would be the moment where, like, other world record runners would close their chats. <laughs> this talking is distracting. 
Anguishing is distracting. Beautiful. Come on, dude. Let's keep it going. Suck it in. Oh my god. I'm creaming. <laughs> I don't know if this makes it. Oh man, it does. I should have backspun, but I didn't trust it. Get the hell in there. It green bounced. It green bounced, dude. Although I should have hit one above. One fourth. I don't like this. Just foreign momentum, please. No. Nope. Drained by the upslope. Get up there. Okay. freaked out at the end of that and put some nasty impact on it. Watch this. Should have hit it harder. Rip. <laughs> I actually know how to make that putt, but I just didn't hit it hard enough. What's up, streamer? Thank you. Yeah, I'm trying to keep it alive right now. It's a stressful one for sure, especially because I didn't power here and I can't remember how hard I need to hit this. All right, I have leniency. Just freaking out a bit, you know, the huge. We got the run. A lifetime. Freak out a bit. That fat upslope to help me out there. Rip 10 seconds. I kind of just forgot where I was going to go. Nice shot. Oh, that sucks really bad. Probably lost like 15 on this hole. That was awful. So I'll just skip pull 18 now. Jesus, that was bad. Yeah, all right, I'm losing like 20 seconds on this split. More if I get unlucky. Mother of Earl, what in the goddamn hell? I said more if I get unlucky. Skip both of these holes and try to uh, try to eagle hole 18, but now obviously that ain't happening. Don't even know why I zoomed that. <sighs> Whatever. Huge time loss here, but it's still alive. My bad lands is not good. Imagine this. <laughs> this would be disgusting. Oh my god, dude. Christ, oh my god. That time loss, though. Sub 930? Cool. I'm fine with it. Forty-four, forty-four, one-four. 
53 is basically impossible. Nice shot. Would require literal perfection. Nice I'm fine shot. with plus 5 here. Excellent. That's why. Good bounce. That was about all I could do to save it. Really? Jesus. Reading those green lines, it's not apparent at all that that curves like that. Wow. Sheesh, dude. Did not expect that to curve that hard. Bad slice. Although it will give me an, an approach shot here, I hope. No. Not exactly what I was hoping for. Let's go. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> Top spin was an overreaction. Ah, shit. I wanted a much larger slice than that. All I want is a par 5 skip. Uh, that slice scared the heck out of me. Stay alive, my 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 friend. Somehow, <laughs> I don't like that. I wanted a slice on it. Really? Really, dude? <laughs> okay. I think I need need to do not power shot here. Goodness, I am. Okay. Well, <laughs> not what I intended. Also got decimated by Crosswind here. I don't think I hit it hard enough. Okay, I did. Let's go. Got to off play or offset that slope. A hard enough shot there. Brutal pin location. I don't know if that makes it. It does. Okay. Let's see where we end up. That's pretty nice. good. Oh. Early bird. Nice bird. Good. Okay. Thought it was raining for just a second. Nice shot. Definitely in my route, Ariel, for sure. So the slice is going to put me way off the T or the pin here, but at least it's safe. Could have honestly played the... I think the slope would have played the win there. That was a dumb shot. I just moved to the left by instinct. I could have probably eagled that. Ooh, that's risky. Ooh, ho, ho. I didn't want to full top it. Oh my god, what is happening? Notice how I have to look at every shot. It's that much of an issue. 
I don't know the pin locations. I don't know the, where the T's shots are going to end up generally. I have to look. On some of them. On this one, I'm not looking. But I think this is not going to work very well because of the wind. Unless it does. I think this isn't hitting fast fairway, so I'll top spin it. Good. Three more. Three more, and I'll have something here. Hello. Oh, no way. Okay, it's fringe, but it's still. That's probably not going in. Yay! <laughs> I birdied Star Badlands 11. Now I'm a certified beast. Let's go, dude. Now this run is worth it. Now I'm feeling justified here. Mm, slice probably goes right of the green. With this wind, it'll pick it up. I didn't know it was back then, though. That's a little surprising to me. Denied. That was a juice purification. Absolutely right. Slice is bad, but I'm not in the rough, I think. Can I get a second shot, though? Or am I under the thing? Okay. My god, just hit the sweet spot, man. Exclamation point backspin. Oh, I almost made that work. Overaimed just a hair. That would have been sick. One more birdie, right? Yeah, let's go. I'm going up here. I don't usually do this, I think. One more birdie, come on. Get over. And sit down. Would have preferred a green bounce here over a fringe. Probably not. Uh-oh. Maybe I'll aim. I'll take the time to aim on 15, I guess. Um... God freaking dang it, why did I have to get plus four on this shot? Why was it good? <laughs> Thank you! Alright, don't miss this. Oh, I hit that pretty hard. Okay, now it's just par. Oof! Come on. Low 54 potential here. Low to mid, I think. Yeah, it'll be a mid 54. I'm going safe strat. <laughs> Screw this run. It's not a power shot, dang it. Let me do it. Be a frame harder than that, though. Minus one. Ending the run. Ayo. Not the slice I wanted, but is it the slice we needed? It is the slice we needed. Let's go, dude. Epic gaming. Oh, oh, man. Well, ain't that just juicy. Look at that fringe. Cheers! <laughs> What the heck? <laughs> yeah, that'll go in the record books. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> oh, 
Oh my god, dude. <laughs> That's one of my top gamer moments for sure. <laughs> oh my god, dude. I'm sweating. Best ending you could have asked for. That was cracked. I am so happy with it. My ears are hot. <laughs> oh, man. Yes, dude. Huge moment. <laughs> Ooh, it paid off. Oh, yes, that's so good. Hey, I'm pretty happy with it. Are you happy with it? I like it. First world record in my new room. I'm popping off. G3, thank you for the five-month resub. Appreciate it. Welcome back, friend. <laughs> Yay. That record was over two years old. Two years ago. Right when I started becoming an absolute beast at this game was when I got the Star Tourney's record. And we beat it! Still improving over the years. Gosh, that's so nice. Just to see it. And that was definitely a 53 without the peach mishap, but hey. It's a sub-930. Badlands not sub-930, but really close. I think that's definitely a good update. I don't think I could go for a 53. <laughs> not with these splits. They're too good. Are they good? What happened? Oh, yeah. Oh, the cheap wasn't that great either. Hey. Sub-9 sands. I mean... I mean... I'm happy with it, I think. <laughs> thank you, Art. I appreciate it. Saria, thank you for the gift sub. Going to rack. Let's go. I appreciate it, Saria. Thank you. That was a good moment. <laughs> yeah, that really came together. I had a minus one on that hole in one, right? Minus one made it so that I bounced on the fringe. And no wind. And it was just a perfect impact point from there played the slope on the green. I was pretty familiar with that pin location. I was happy I got it, too. It's the easiest one to aim from the um, star tourney. The back tees. I put it together, dude. Nice, dude. 54-17. I was pretty sure that was going to be a 2x, so I got the 1x with that clutch moment. I like that. <laughs> 